So I just toss sugar and water in the skillet. One part of water, one part of sugar. I do not measure, sorry. And we decided to add one teaspoon of <laughs> gingerbread spices. Yes, I know spring is in the air, but yeah, we still got gingerbread spices, so why not use them? Want to stir it in? We're gonna stir this in gently, and then we're just gonna leave it alone. That's very gently. Cooking with love, cooking with love. So, the sugar is incorporated into the water, so it's now a syrup and not thick enough. So at this moment you want to stop stirring, stop it, and just leave it. Move to note, do not dip your finger in the pan. Not dip your finger in the pan? No, don't. It looks delicious, but it's not delicious for you. You're not supposed to dip your finger in there? Mm -hmm. Oh man. And we continue not stirring the syrup, but as you can see the bubbles are changing. Almost ready to toss in the peanuts and the pecans. What do you think, Flo? Mm -hmm. Looks good. <laughs> Alrighty, so the syrup is, as you can see, nice and thick. And because I'm impatient, we're gonna toss the nuts in there. You ready, Flo? Yeah. Mm. No, I think. covered with the syrup and we're just gonna leave it for a little bit but keep your eye on it all right so as you can see the consistency is changing they're almost done I don't know if you can tell but they've got like the sugary crust now and sometimes we leave them like this because we do like the sugary crust can you tell yeah but if you wait for just a little bit longer, but just be careful you don't burn them at this point. It's gonna be even better. Can you see the caramel? That's what we want. So you really have to be careful because it's gonna burn really quickly at this point. But those streaks of caramel, that's the best, that's what we want. Almost done. Alright, 